Sitting on the bus yesterday, there she is. The most beautiful girl with jiggly earrings. The seat next to her is empty and I start to see things. The possibilities are endless and so I calculate whilst I feel my nose beginning to menstruate. Wiping the blood from my nose, I swing myself into position. My body feels like it's undergoing nuclear fission. Having ancient female knowledge, I know how to make this girl mine. And I shakily ask for her zodiac sign. <laughs> she turns to me with a look full of scorn and arrogantly says, I am a Capricorn. She then asks for my imaginary space symbol and her voice makes me feel oh so small. My response is to be most frank. I am a Gemini, like my hide and seek idol, Anna Frank. She gets up to go to another seat. Already I can taste my defeat. This girl looks at me with unholy determination. Her eyes tell me she wants my star people in a camp of concentration. I plead to her desperately, please, won't you give me another chance? She replies, I'm not interested in writing your bad romance. This is when I pull out my joker. I had googled my star sign earlier that day. Apparently, Geminis are usually impulsive rapists. And that was when I realised that girls are space racists. So, you know, Geminis and Capricorns belong together, like 40-year-olds and online poker. <laughs> or at least, so claimed the crazy online star sign chart. But this beautiful creature breaks my heart. She spits in my face, grabs her coach bag, and sits some other place. I shout after her. M maybe we could still be friends. But no reply comes. And this sad story ends. Thank <laughs> you.